In today's video, I'm going to show you how to do the unboxing and a complete setup of your Epson Workforce 2930 printer. So this is a printer you can use for wireless printing, scanning, copy, also the fax. So let's start with the unboxing. It comes with the power cable and set of four ink cartridges. Plug in the power cable. Press the power button. Go to the printer control panel and select your language. Press OK. So if you want you can start using the Epson Smart Panel app for the setup or you can select No and click OK. Now select your country of residence. Select date and time. We have to install the setup ink cartridges. At the side of the printer you have an option to open the ink chamber. So lift from this side like this and it will hold itself. So we also get the setup ink cartridges. So take the ink cartridges out of the packaging. Also remove this yellow seal. So you just have to push it like this. I repeat it for all four ink cartridges. And remove the seal for every ink cartridge. So select the ink cartridges according to the color. So let's start with the black. The chip should be facing forward on the chip side and select correct color and the alphabets. So just press it down, it will lock itself. Now the yellow. That's magenta. So you just have to press it down. It's very easy to install these ink cartridges. Close the ink chamber, so lift it up, let it go, lift it up again and let it go completely down. Go to the printer screen and click on the OK button. Scroll ahead. And now click on the start button. So it's going to activate the ink system. It's going to take around 6 minutes. Click on the OK button. Now if you want you can just adjust the print quality or you can do it later. So I'm just going to click on the adjust later. So click OK. Next is to next is to do the fax setting. You can do it now or you can also set up it later. So I'll do it later. Now we can see our printer is ready for the copy. Next is to do the wireless setup or Wi-Fi setup. Scroll ahead. And it will take you to the option that is the settings option. Now click OK. Scroll ahead and look for network settings. Wi-Fi setup. Wi-Fi recommended. Click OK to proceed. Wi-Fi setup wizard. It will display the list of Wi-Fi networks. Select your Wi-Fi network. And press OK. Enter your Wi-Fi password. So you can change alphabets from here, numbers. Once we enter the password, click OK to confirm. And it will start the Wi-Fi setup. So printer is connected to the Wi-Fi. If we press the home button, we can go back. Next is to connect this printer with the device for printing and scanning. Go to the iPhone and open the Epson Smart Panel app. So I'm going to use Epson Smart Panel app. And click OK. Agree. On the main screen we have to add the printer so click plus button on the top. In the app select connect to a product already on Wi-Fi. So you will see your Epson Workforce 2930 series. Select it. Connection is complete. Click OK. And you should be able to see your printer on the top. Now we are ready to use this printer for wireless printing and scanning. For example to do a print. Select any document, select a document and click on the print button. On the next screen you can change settings and once you are ready 
click on the start button to take the paper tray out that is here Next is to do the scanning. So go back on the main screen, you will see scan option. For scanning, we can use the scanner or we can use the automatic document feeder tray. So I'm just going to use the ADF tray right now. Place it here, click on the scan button, change the settings if you want, and click on the start button. Automatically, it will start the scanning process. So it's a very good printer for office use because it also has a fax but if you want to use it for the home even then it is a good printer and the price is really good as well. Now you can save it or if you want you can share it. So this way we can do the complete setup of this printer and we can start using it for wireless printing and scanning. Thanks for watching.